Ready to be rich? ETFs versus stocks. Hey there, future millionaires. Ever dreamt of swimming in a pool of cash? Me too. Today, we're diving into the world of ETFs and stocks. We'll figure out which one can make you richer, faster. Get ready for a wild ride with charts, insights, and even a surprise worth 21,000 rupees. ETFs, the easy button for investing. So, what's an ETF? Let's dive in and explore this fascinating investment tool. Imagine a basket of different stocks all bundled up neatly. That's an ETF. It's like having a collection of various investments all in one place, making it easier to manage and track. They track specific markets or sectors. For example, you can have an ETF that focuses on technology companies, healthcare, or even renewable energy. This allows you to invest in a particular industry without having to pick individual stocks. Think of it like buying a slice of the entire pizza instead of just one topping. Each slice represents a different stock or asset within the ETF, giving you a taste of everything. ETFs spread your risk across multiple stocks. This diversification means that if one stock doesn't perform well, the impact on your overall investment is minimized. It's like having a safety net for your investments. By spreading your money across various assets, you reduce the risk of losing everything if one company fails. ETFs usually have lower fees than actively managed funds. This is because they are passively managed, meaning they simply track an index rather than having a team of analysts making decisions. More money in your pocket. Lower fees mean you get to keep more of your returns, which can significantly boost your investment over time. Trading ETFs is as simple as clicking a button. You can buy and sell them just like individual stocks through your brokerage account, making them highly accessible and convenient. ETFs might not skyrocket like a single superstar stock. While they offer steady growth, they are less likely to experience the dramatic highs and lows of individual stocks. You're buying the whole basket, even the slightly bruised apples. This means that while you get the benefit of diversification, you also get the less than perfect performers in the mix. But overall, the stability and reduced risk make ETFs a smart choice for many investors. Educating yourself about ETFs and how they fit into your investment strategy can be a game changer. They offer a balanced approach to investing, combining the benefits of diversification, lower fees and ease of trading. So, if you're looking for a straightforward, cost-effective way to invest, consider ETFs. They truly are the easy button for investing, helping you build a robust and diversified portfolio with minimal hassle. Stocks Picking winners like a pro Now let's talk stocks. The stock market can seem like a daunting place, but with the right knowledge and strategy, you can navigate it like a pro. Owning a stock means owning a tiny piece of a company. When you buy shares, you become a part owner of that business. This ownership gives you a stake in the company's future and potential profits. It's like being a mini owner of your favorite brand. Imagine walking into a store and knowing you own a piece of it. This connection can make investing more personal and exciting. If you pick a winner, your investment can skyrocket. The value of your shares can increase significantly, leading to substantial financial gains. This is the dream scenario for every investor. You decide which companies to invest in and when to buy or sell. This control allows you to tailor your investment strategy to your financial goals and risk tolerance. It's all about making informed decisions. Some companies share their profits with shareholders through dividends. Free money. Dividends are a great way to earn passive income from your investments, providing regular payouts that can be reinvested or spent as you see fit. Individual stocks can be volatile. One bad tweet and your investment could plummet. The stock market is influenced by many factors, including news, economic indicators and investor sentiment. This volatility can be both an opportunity and a risk. Picking winning stocks takes time, effort and a bit of luck. Researching companies, analyzing financial statements and staying updated on market trends are all part of the process. It's a challenging but rewarding endeavor that requires dedication and a willingness to learn. 
Remember, even the most seasoned investors don't always get it right. But with persistence and a solid strategy, you can increase your chances of success. Nifty 50 Showdown ETFs versus Stocks in Action Let's bring this battle to life with some real-world examples from India's Nifty 50 Index. This ETF tracks the Nifty 50 Index. It's like owning a piece of India's top 50 companies. The oil-to-telecom giant is a major player in the Nifty 50. This banking behemoth is known for its stability and growth. A leading IT company riding the wave of India's tech boom. Technical Smackdown Charts Don't Lie Technical analysis uses charts and indicators to predict future price movements. It's like reading the stock market's mind. ETFs often follow broader market trends. These can help identify buy and sell signals. Head and shoulders, double bottoms. These patterns can reveal bullish or bearish signals. RSI, MACD and others can provide insights into momentum and potential reversals. Fundamental Face-Off – Digging into the Numbers Fundamental analysis focuses on a company's financial health. It's like giving a potential investment a thorough background check. Understand the economic outlook for the sector the ETF tracks. Analyze the individual stocks within the ETF and their performance. Check the company's revenue, profits and future guidance. Too much debt can be a red flag. Strong leadership is crucial for long-term success. ETFs versus stocks. Which one wins the crown? So, which is the ultimate wealth-building weapon? It depends. Both ETFs and stocks have their own unique advantages and disadvantages, and the right choice for you will depend on your individual financial goals, risk tolerance, and investment strategy. ETFs are like the reliable family car, safe, consistent, and gets you where you need to go. They offer diversification, which means your investment is spread across a variety of assets, reducing the risk of any single asset dragging down your entire portfolio. This makes ETFs a great choice for those who prefer a more conservative approach to investing. Stocks, on the other hand, are like the flashy sports car, exciting, potentially lucrative, but with a higher risk of crashing. Investing in individual stocks can offer significant returns if you pick the right companies, but it also comes with the risk of losing a substantial portion of your investment if those companies underperform. Stocks are ideal for those who are willing to take on more risk in exchange for the possibility of higher rewards. Choose ETFs if you're new to investing and want a simple, diversified approach. ETFs are easy to buy and sell, and they often come with lower fees compared to mutual funds. They can be a great way to get started in the world of investing without having to spend a lot of time researching individual companies. Choose ETFs if you prefer a hands-off approach and don't have time for extensive research. Many ETFs are passively managed, meaning they track a specific index and require minimal oversight. This makes them a convenient option for busy professionals who want to invest without having to constantly monitor their portfolio. Choose stocks if you enjoy researching companies and picking potential winners. Investing in individual stocks allows you to take a more active role in your investment strategy. And it can be incredibly rewarding if you have a knack for identifying undervalued companies with strong growth potential. Choose stocks if you're comfortable with higher risk and the potential for higher rewards. Stocks can be volatile and their prices can fluctuate significantly in the short term. However, for those who are willing to ride out the ups and downs, the long-term gains can be substantial. Ultimately, the choice between ETFs and stocks comes down to your personal preferences and financial goals. Whether you prefer the steady, reliable growth of ETFs or the thrilling high-stakes world of individual stocks, there's a wealth-building strategy out there that's right for you. Claim your surprise. Ours 21,000 awaits. Congratulations on becoming an ETF and stock market whiz. Now, for the surprise I promised. 
Subscribe to our channel and send a screenshot of your confirmation to WhatsApp number 9113211787. You'll instantly receive access to a treasure chest of investment resources worth Rs 21,000. Don't miss out.